High fire energies, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising in those cross-watching. Welcome to your Tarot Love Messages. Today we're going to take a look at and see what could have been. So this reading key is tailored for those of you who have been, you know, who have been connected to someone very special in the past and for one reason or another they got away or things just ended between the two of you, you know, whether it's time or distance that got in the way or whether the two of you were at just two very different stages. So we want to see what could have been had you stayed together, okay? Maybe this is your one that got away. Maybe this is the one you could have had. For whatever reason, you guys ended up on, you know, complete two separate paths. We want to see what the cards predict for you had the two of you stayed together. Would it have been that happily ever after that you always desired? Or, you know, was it a good thing that you guys ended up on separate paths? We'll see what the cards say for you. This is going to be a general reading, so please just keep that in mind. If you are after personal reading with myself, please feel free to reach out. I will list my email just below the video here. So I'm going to give the cards a shuffle here, and we'll see what they predict for you, how the two of you stay together. Okay, so for some, for a lot of you, you were dealing with a, um, an Earth energy, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or someone who had a lot of, I feel like they had Earth placements in their chart, or maybe this is you that's coming up. Okay, this is someone who I feel like you've invested a lot of your time, and if not, if it's not just your time, it's definitely your, a lot of your effort and energy into this connection, okay? Emotionally, spiritually, physically, you've invested a lot into this connection. Unfortunately, you didn't feel like you got the same back in return. And for a lot of you, I feel like this is someone whom you've spent a lot of time, you, you were very patient with this person and you've, you've given yourself a long, it feels like you were waiting for this person. Maybe you were waiting for this person to come around. Maybe you were waiting for them to, you know, work on themselves and for them to build on a better relationship with this person. Maybe you were waiting until things just finally figured itself out. It feels like you were waiting for forever for this person, but unfortunately I feel like the very thing that you were waiting for never truly came. So what could have been had you stayed together? I don't know that things would have been that much better for you guys, given what the energies are telling me. The Two of Pentacles tells me that I feel like you would have continued to do this song and dance for um, quite some time here, because to me it feels like the Two of Pentacles is a very frivolous type of energy. It's an imbalanced kind of energy as well. And I feel like maybe you were dealing with someone who was never really sure about this connection. Or maybe they just weren't as invested as you were in this connection. There was a lot of inconsistencies. Maybe this person was very up and down. I don't know if they actually um, were dealing with a few things. Like mentally and emotionally. Or I don't know if just this person had a lot going on in their life. And they were just very... A very indecisive kind of energy. I think that would have gone on for quite some time. I feel like that inconsistency and that hot and cold kind of energy, that on and off, I feel like that would have continued to play out. Notice the infinity loop in the card here. Um, you were dealing with someone who I feel like wasn't really taking this connection as serious. And I'm also seeing that this person had... I feel like they had behavioral patterns and some of those behavioral patterns were, I can see that they were very closed off, especially with the four of pentacles. I feel like you were dealing with someone who had a lot of insecurities and some of those insecurities, they were insecure about getting emotionally involved with someone, about opening up themselves to someone, about, you know, getting to know someone because I feel like there may, they may have been fears of getting hurt. Your person may have been really hurt in the past. Your person may have had, you know, uh, trust issues and I feel like their defense mechanism was to keep you at a distance which is what they did and I feel like unless the, the unless they untangle some of those issues some of those insecurities this relationship this connection would not have improved and I feel like your person he would have continued to clutch onto those behavioral patterns onto onto those holding patterns that I see around them Notice how that fourth pentacle or that second pentacle, depending on which way you count it, um, is placed in front of his heart. It almost acts like a shield. Your person was so scared of opening up and letting you in. They weren't incapable of doing that, but they were so scared that 
the funny thing is they were scared that you they were scared to love you because they you were someone they could love and if love is something that they were that they're so scared of they were going to stay away from it i hope that makes sense and i didn't confuse you okay because they knew that you were someone they could love this is why they never fully let you in and unfortunately those insecurities and those anxieties or those you know feelings of inadequacies would have continued to play out to play out in this connection and someone he would have continued to wait and wait and wait until you know they couldn't wait anymore so for a lot of you i feel like walking away may have been the best decision you would have made because you know there's no point in sitting in sitting around a table when love is just not being served on the menu and again I'm not saying that this person is incapable of that I'm just saying that this person is too scared to give you the things that you wanted or that you needed or to give you the love that you deserved purely because they have insecurities of their own that they had to work through and resolve so I see that this person is still clutching on to holding patterns I see that the energy is still very much inconsistent for a lot of you there may have been someone else in the picture and maybe this is what has made them so indecisive as they were torn between you and another energy and unfortunately there was definitely a lack of uh, equilibrium and had you stayed together I feel like it would have continued to play out okay this person like this person would have still been torn between you their future and this and this person that they were involved with which is someone that they've had past or a history with so notice the frustrated expression on the old on the well he's not old on the figure's face here I feel like had you stayed you could have probably invested. I was going to say wasted, but I don't mean for it to sound insulting, but I feel like you would have invested a lot more time and a lot more energy into something that I feel like couldn't need, couldn't meet your needs or your expectations. Or I feel like this person couldn't give you what you want, what you wanted. The other thing I want to point out is notice how there are two sides to every coin and two sides to every pentacle, right? And I feel like the two of you were just on two separate journeys, okay? Notice how, you know, the, the, the two of pentacles are mismatched and they're just on two different wavelengths. And I feel like the two of you were on two separate journeys. And the reason why you're not together is because they weren't ready to go, you know, where you were going. They weren't ready for all the places where you were going here. Um, there was a lot of resistance here. Could be you or the two of you, I feel like, really fought a lot. There was a lot of, like, conflict or aggression or just... I don't know if this is you or trying to... You felt like maybe this person was constantly attacking you or you felt like you constantly had to defend and prove yourself to them and you felt like you had to prove like you were worthy of their love. Or I don't know if this is, like, you constantly being met with resistance from this person, which explains a lot because you guys were just in complete different wavelengths. You guys were completely out of vibrational alignment with one another i feel like if the two of you were really patient and if the person spent some time building a better relationship with themselves and just untangling some of these issues i feel like maybe you guys could have worked things through because especially with justice it's a card of you know just and truth and honest and i feel like if the two of you were really more honest about each other and about your own flaws and insecurities and if you would have like honest there and if you were open to resolving them then your connection with this person definitely would have benefited from this but i feel like your person was just even too closed off to even explore those insecurities and i feel like i still feel as though to this day your person is still struggling with those issues those insecurities are still struggling with opening up here so there could have been that opportunity but i feel like that opportunity would only have been beneficial if you guys took advantage of it okay so and i'm seeing with balance i feel like you guys were really i've mentioned this earlier i feel like you guys were really out of alignment with one another you guys were to me it just feels like you were different on different wavelengths on different pages and you didn't always see eye to eye and i feel like you were just on different paths here and again i feel like a lot of the reason why you guys went separate ways is because they weren't going for all the places that you were headed and you know they weren't ready or you weren't ready here it just feels like the two of you ended up in separate places because i feel like you both had your own journeys to undertake and unfortunately you know you can't always take the people that enter your life you can't always take them with you because everyone is on their own journey here and to me it feels like 
maybe if you guys had been a little bit more patient with each other and if you guys had been more honest with each other and for those of you that were involved in a third party situation if there would have been some honesty there and if there would have been you know a balance there then I feel like maybe there would have been hope for this connection but I just feel like your person here was dealing with too many insecurities they were plagued by too many insecurities to actually work on the connection because to me it feels like they weren't ready for a relationship because they had to build a better relationship with themselves so they were suffering um, in the relationship that they had with, them, with themselves. So of course your relationship was going to suffer as a result. Okay, so I feel like for a lot of you, look, things would have played, things would have continued to play it out, to play out the way that they did. Okay, a lot of you, were, you felt like you were going around in circles and getting nowhere was like a revolving door. And, you know, you've invested so much time in your energy, you were met with so much time and energy, you were met with resistance, your person was very closed off, was very guarded, you wanted to restore balance, you wanted an equi equilibrium, you wanted to, you know, work through this and you were patient, but I feel like you also realized that you guys were just out of sync with one another and at the end of the day you guys were just two very different people I guess. Okay guys, and these are your messages, thank you as always for watching and listening, please show your support by subscribing to this channel. I will be sharing with you more tarot love messages, so stay tuned. For those of you after a personal reading, feel free to reach out. Otherwise, bye for now.